Okay, how do PAMPs and antigens relate? So hopefully you've already watched um, what proteins are, what are antigens, and basic definition of PAMPs. Um, so an example, this is one example, we can go back to any of these examples of PAMPs that we saw before, but so here's a bacteria with a flagella. So we define the flagella, the whole thing, as a PAMP, a pattern, uh, sorry, a pathogen associated molecular pattern. The antigen, if we remember, is just a little part of the PAMP, and it's the actual sequence of either amino acids or nucleic acids that the body recognizes as both foreign and harmful. So remember, the PAMP is the big structure like a flagella, cilia, um, a, cell, a, a cell wall of the bacteria, or the viral RNA, DNA. The antigen is the actual short sequence of amino acids or nucleotides that an antibody can specifically bind to and recognizes foreign and harmful.